Hi there, Greg Holmeson with another two minute update on all things Philippines recruitment from the Philippines Recruitment Company. This is where we go through what the government's saying, what the government's doing, what our clients are saying and what we are doing. So firstly, the government's saying that borders are closed. Now in practice, that doesn't mean we're not bringing people into the country as we know. So how people are getting in is under a travel exemption. So we are also able to get our clients travel exemptions as long as the candidates coming in are on the critical skills shortage list and the work that they're doing is linked to essential services. Now that could be mining infrastructure, logistics, um, healthcare. There's plenty of uh, categories that we can use to try and bring our candidates into the country to meet the needs of our clients. So that's what the government's doing practically. And so what are our clients saying? So many of our clients are saying now that they have a, a skills shortage that is worse than prior pandemic levels. So that is becoming a real challenge for plenty of our clients and that then has triggered the um, activity that we've now got going on in the Philippines as far as recruitment is concerned because we also have now got interest for our business that is bigger than pre-COVID. So that's what our clients are saying. They're also looking at what's coming up and we have hundreds of billions of dollars of infrastructure projects coming up. And in fact, uh, BRW this morning was saying that one of the concerns with meeting the deadlines for those projects will be the skills shortage that we have in Australia right now. So we're now very busily uh, recruiting in the Philippines. There's plenty of activity going on up there. We are seeing a very busy year ahead um, and we're looking forward, which I didn't think I would be saying a few months ago, we're looking forward to ripping into this year and being able to get our activity back up and running with meeting the demand of what we're seeing is going to be very significant here in Australia. The other thing that I'm doing is I'm available for any boardroom discussions or presentations to help understand the ins and outs of recruiting out of the Philippines and what we're doing at the moment. Again, Greg Holmeson with, our, with my two minute bite on what's happening with Philippines recruitment. Uh, looking forward to working with you. Cheers.